phrase du bac c'est bad gas. I need that. I'm all left by sitting good. I'm all left by sitting good. I'm all I'm all left by I'm all by sitting good. I'm all left I'm all left I'm all left I'm all left I'm all Uh, I mean, music started for me, you know, um, I put out a mixtape, you know, 2009, I think that was the beginning, you know, that was the beginning of the, the introduction of Files, the bad guy. It was called Shakara the Mixtape, and this is where I just, you know, explain, you know, my style, I just portray so everybody can see, you know, that this guy is a little bit of a mixture of a Raz, and also a cool guy, so, you know, when I come through with the, with the fresh sort of persona, they know it's far as a bad guy, and at the same time, when I change it to be Raz, they still know far as it's still a bad guy, you know, <laughs> so Shakara the Mixtape was first, then I put out some singles, what's up guy, cool party, one, two, three, high class, and then currency, so that was the latest. Working with Max was, you know, was was easy, was was smooth, and you know when we um <clears throat> when we came when we came about the concept, I was a bit, you know. Um, iffy about how it was going to turn out but at the end of the day he executed perfectly and everything came out good you know obviously there's a, there's a message behind the song so we, we in the video we twisted it around and made it something you know still positive and that was what we were trying to do and you know currency obviously came after that and that was a continuation of the high class video and uh, yeah I miss it up you know I'm something like a Mr. Naira at the same time Mr. Dollar Mr. Euro and Mr. Pants I got her the currency that's what I'm trying to say <laughs> She might buy you, she might buy the Bronx, she might buy you, yeah. she might buy the Bronx, she might buy you. Yeah, yeah Fouse the Bad Guy is always working, you know. I'm always working on making some beautiful music. You know, I already put out something that was hot, Jessica, just recently in 2014, and you know, it was very different. You know, so people were like, hey, where is this one coming from? You know, because I mix it up with a little bit of a Fuji twist to it, you know. So they are a little confused. Like, is this guy hip hop or is he a Fuji star? What is really his calling? So, you know, I'm, I'm somebody that I, I, I like to try new things. You know, it's music. You have to experiment. You understand? So uh, 2014 is going to be a big year for me. My, my, my debut album is dropping. You know, that's going to be out on the 30th of May. 2014 so this is gonna be the year of the takeover so that's my plan you know i plan to take over in 2014 so watch out for the album man and i'm already saying i get to it too shugani you are welcome to my cool party cash grooves do fudgy and let the cc no say you got it you won't get your on the um the producers i worked with on the album studio magic um they they were heavy on it um sparks Spax Classic, he's, he's a brilliant guy, you know, he, he's talented. Um, I worked with Spells, I worked with Ade, you know, so it, it, was, it was a mix of sounds, it was a mix of sounds, you know. Artists-wise, I worked with Yemi Alade, I worked with Show Them Camp, I worked with Olamide, I worked with Poe, I worked with Sadauda, and I worked with Dickbo. And Phenom, I worked with Phenom as well, how could I forget? Um, yeah, I think that's it. That's about it, you know. This way she won, yeah. I make a tasty life, make she come here. Yeah. And if she like the life, we take to you too. Shugani, you are welcome to my cool party. Cash grooves, do fudgy. I let the CC no say you call you. I think things are improving, you know, in, in, in the music industry now. Um, in terms of structure, people are starting to create a structure for themselves, you know. Before, there was a problem of piracy, of, you know, releasing an album, and then the Alaba boys picking it up and pirating it. But now, that one is even more, there's even more of a structure as regards that one. Now, if you drop your album, you go to the Alaba boys, you know, you give them the rights to redistribute and resell your album. And then there is a share of income, of course, you know, like with every distributor. So with that, there's a bit more of a structure. But with the general industry at large, ah, you know, things are a bit difficult, you know, there's a, a lot of things are just like this anyhow. Like in the whole of the country, you know, every almost every industry would portray the state of the country. In Nigeria, a lot of things are not the way they should be. There isn't a lot of structure in the country. So in our music industry, people are just doing things anyhow. Like for example, you know, 
you know, a lot of artists will complain to you that, you know, getting their music heard is a challenge, you know, because there's some things that they have to, there's some rituals that they have to perform, you know, there are some hands that they have to shake, you understand me? So, you know, with that, there's no structure. But, you know, with, with, with um, Koson, you know, coming into, coming into the, the picture, they, 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 they apparently collect royalties on behalf of artists and remit those royalties on behalf of artists. But then there's another question that we do they really remit those royalties in, in, in the actual amount that they've collected? You know, these are a lot of issues that I want you to really consider. You know, but I mean, with generally I would say, you know, it's still tough. It's still a growing industry, you know, so there isn't a proper structure yet. But I believe with the special grace of God, we'll get there. We'll get there. I hope that, you know, there's more transparency and more, and everyone, you know, aims to be more organized. Yeah. Okay. One thing I would say if you if you believe that you're actually talented at music and you you know you actually really have the gift, then just be determined, just keep doing what you do, you know, keep at it, keep recording your stuff, keep writing, you know, and one day someone, you know, out there will probably come and get you and you know invest in you you know so i don't want anyone to feel like you know i've been trying so hard and music is not connecting for me just keep on doing what you're doing you know i think determination perseverance you know these are features that really make successful people actually successful so you know if you really want to be successful just keep at it keep doing what you do far as the bad guys say so I know fit try, but I'm worth it. You will see why I have me, need my currency. I get loving, I get plenty. Jash is simple, jala gently. Scope the Volvo, go Japanti. I know follow, carry shoulder. If you wanna reach me, it's at Files the Bad Guy. That's F-A-L-Z-T-H-E-B-A-H-D-G-U-Y. On Twitter and on Instagram, it's the same thing. On Facebook, it's Files. That's F-A-L-Z. So like the page, become a fan. I'm out there, always there to holler at you. Holler at me, I holler back. Files the bad guy. Thank you. I'm not I'm class, I'm not Check. Oh my bola, bola lo mo, a booking ball, who I don't know. I don't tell them to bring the dollars, leave the dollar, meet the bolas. I don't calculate in Sinaira, don't compare me to Ismaila, oh Mukaila, I'm the shaman, even our hot drink is designer. <laughs> yeah, my name is Faust, aka Faust the bad guy. They also call me the what's up guy. Runs on E Extra, that's what you've been watching. Keep watching, thank you very much. <laughs> I'm not cheap, pay more, more.